as far as the three habits are concerned, it's something that we have been taught probably from childhood. It's not something that we are initiating new, newly or uh, it's not something so, so very, uh, you know, alien to us. As a culture, we have understood it from the time that we were kids. Our parents, our grandparents, our great, in my case, my great grandmother as well, <laughs> has, has uh, you know, kind of taught us as children. You know, beta, khane se pehle, haat mu dholo. Beta, naha, beta, bathroom se nikle ho, to pehle to haat dhona hai aapko. To ye jo hai, mujhe lagta hai, ek, uh, ek, uh, we are a culture of words, probably more than visual, or uh, we, are an, we are a verbal culture. We remember what our parents and our grandparents have taught us because they've been telling us. So they have passed the stories down, passed the traditions down to us as children. And as grown-ups, I hope that I will be able to pass that on to my children as well. Um, and this, I think, these three habits of having clean water, clean toilets, and washing your hands with soap. I think these three habits, where earlier they were tradition, they were culture, have now become a necessity. Pehle ke zamane mein bolte the ki, you know, ghao pe bas matti laga do, thik ho jayegi. Aaj ke zamane mein agar aap matti lagaoge, to matlab pehle aapko doctor bolega ki aapka dimag kharaab hai. Septicemia ho jayega, ye ho jayega, wo ho jayega. Pehle to isko injection de do, ye kar do, wo kar do. To I think, to jaise kehte hai ki mitti badal gayi hai, pani badal gayi hai, pani badal gaya hai, hawa badal gayi hai, duniya badal gayi hai. और जो पहले जमाने में एक आदत हुआ करती थी आज के जमाने में एक जरूरत है टुडे वी कैन चेंज आवर हैबिट्स एंड चेंज आवर कंट्री बिकॉज़ ऑफ दैट एंड लाइक आई सेड बिफोर व्हाई एम आई हियर आई थिंक बिकॉज़ द नेक्स्ट जनरेशन इज इंपॉर्टेंट एंड आई सॉ दिस अमेजिंग वीडियो ऑन ऑन यूट्यूब आई आई डोंट नो वेदर आई पुट इट आउट ऑन ट्विटर और नॉट बट आई सॉ दिस अमेजिंग वीडियो विद दिस 13 ईयर ओल्ड स्टूड अप ऑन स्टेज and she talked about what her world was like versus what our world is like today and she said where you know you all could go freely and play in the mud whenever you like today we don't have that much mud to play around in and the mud that we have is dirty and has too many germs for us to even think about it where you all had rivers where you had flowing healthy you know rivers and you had so much to uh, to watch to see to experience we have dirty polluted water we can't even see a river in places so i think that's why i am here today i am here for the next generation i am here so that our children i wouldn't say mine but our children can probably stand up and say and that they're proud of us for taking our world and um, and them and their future seriously and maybe to stand up and do something about it rather than just standing up and saying oh you know there's nothing that i can do about it yes you can every one of us can stand up and take just that little bit of social responsibility and stand up and say okay i may not be the richest man in the world or i may not be the most uh, pro, uh, most um, uh, you know uh, the most influential man in the world but at least i can influence my own environment and i can influence the people around me to better habits and really it's honestly simple that's one of the things that um, i did at home just to give you a just to give you an example so we have servants from all over the country who come and stay with us obviously so that was one of the things that we had to educate them about was that how clean water makes a difference how a clean toilet makes a difference to them when they are living with us they realize the importance of clean water clean hands because i scream and shout my guts out that they have to wash their hands before they wash my vegetables and uh, and uh, and a clean toilet and at the end of it they are healthier they rarely fall sick for that very reason and they're going to go back and they're going to go back to their villages and to their families and they're going to go back with these habits to say that okay you know hum hum dekho hamari hamari sehat kitni achhi ho gayi hai wahan pe hum to bimar zyada tar padte hi nahi hai kyunki hum ye sab cheeze karte hai ab hame ghar pe bhi ye karna chahiye so that is just just a small 
change. That's just a small thought process change that we have affected, that I have affected, and I'm sure a lot of people have affected in their homes and uh, lives. And um, I think that that's where we came up with the playing billion idea as well. And um, I have really that nothing more to say besides the fact that, uh, you know, we believe that cleanliness is next, next to godliness. And uh, if godliness, if we all inspire, aspire towards godliness, I think the first step towards that would be to make a cleaner, better India. Thank you.